back to my channel, Rachel Reviews. We have a Wantable unboxing today. I'm still trying to figure out my setup here. I have like, a, like, what is this? A file cabinet in front of me. If you can see, oh, I'm trying to figure out the best way to do this. I don't know. Still haven't found my decorations. I haven't opened the box yet. You'll be proud of me. Look, I didn't open it. I didn't peek at it. Wantable is really hard to peek at, but it's possible. <laughs> if you wait till like it's supposed to arrive, you can go on their page and be like, oh, I got my box, and you can look at stuff. Um, so my friend Mari and Nicole at work did do that for me, and they looked right in front of me. <laughs> I let them. So it was very tempting. And then when I got this today, I was like, I'm just gonna at least look at the bundle. And I cut the one side of the tape, but I held back. I was like, no, I'm just gonna wait. So here we go, we're slicing into it. If you wanna try Wantable, there's a link down below. My referral link if you wanna try it. I would get credit if you use it, no pressure. Um, you get seven items they send you. This is a special edit. I can't remember what this one's called, but I'm sure it'll tell me in the note. It was like Sparkle and Shine or like something like that. So it's supposed to be like fancier, I don't know, holiday stuff. Okay, I always <laughs> rip the tissue paper when I try to unpack the bundle. So I'm just gonna flop it over. Ooh, okay. Ready? We're getting the first look at the bundle. That's pretty from what I can see so far. Ooh, so there's like sparklies, there's like a pattern. I see some studs in there, so I'm excited. And the cute little sticker says, styled for Rachel. If you want to learn more about Wantable, it's going to be in the description below because I can't remember everything. <laughs> I do too many of these, I can't remember. Making you shine, that's what it's called. Making you shine edit. Okay, I want to look. The one side has the items and the other side has the notes. So. Hi Rachel, confession, this could be my favorite themed edit ever. From understated elegance to full on glitz and glam, it's so special that I get to pick out pieces designed to make you shine. With family festivities and webcam calls with friends, I don't do that, but you know, I selected items that you can wear all season long. You, you're one of a kind. Your edit should be too, hope you love it, be sure to let me know. Enjoy, Shauna. I don't think I've had Shauna before. So that's exciting. So each um, edit they call, you can get like a style edit, active edit, sometimes they have the themed edits like this one. Um, it's $20 towards uh, the edit. And then you get to put that $20 towards what you keep in the box. Thank you from all of us at Wantable. We love to take a moment, say how grateful we are for you, helping you to be your best. You is why we are here. Do, 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 blah, 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 blah. It's basically just like a thank you card. Grateful, whatever. Yeah, anyway, that's nice. Has the return envelope. Um, they now have it where you can do a UPS or USPS return. I prefer the USPS, you can just put it in your mailbox or drop it in your mailbox, whatever. We're gonna keep that, because I'm sure I'm not gonna be keeping everything. <laughs> All right, and then the first thing we have looks like to be some jewelry. I'm gonna put the note over here too, with the price sheet on the back, because I don't wanna scare myself. <laughs> All right, so the first thing is some jewelry, which Nicole and uh, Mari lied to me and told me there was no jewelry in it. Those are cute. I'm gonna unwrap it all the way. Okay, so here is the earring. It's very dainty. It's like that little gold kind of balls over it. These earrings I kept from one of my wantable boxes. See if you can see up close. But that straight part at the top goes through your ear, obviously, and it has those little gold balls. So. That's pretty cute. I like that. It's very like dainty but elegant at the same time. Put that back in. Cute. We'll try those. Obviously. I'm gonna put those up here because I'll lose them otherwise. I need to get like a table or something in here. All right, next thing is like a clutch. That's really pretty. Look at that. Super metallic-y. It's really pretty. I have nowhere to use it right now though. <laughs> but 
But super cute. The inside there has like little stars. And this is the strap. Full. It has a zipper pocket. It has another pocket in there. It has a pocket on this outside part. I love, I love the metallic. It's like a purple metallic or something. Can you tell? That's really pretty. I don't think I'll keep it because like I said, I have nowhere to use it right now, but that is so cute that you could use it as just a clutch or have that strap. Set that down there. Let's get into the clothes. I like accessories, but I'm a clothes girl. <laughs> All right, here is the first top, which I love. It's so soft, it's like a dolman. Look at those studs on it. Oh my gosh, and it's super stretchy. Heather Gray. That is really cute. I wonder if that's one of the ones Mari said I would like. And then the sleeves has kind of like a slight balloon sleeve. I like that a lot. I like that. You guys. Oh, that's really cute. It's probably really expensive because it's really soft. <laughs> All right, I like that first one. Let's see. Oh, this one feels really nice too. What are you? Oh, you're like a turtleneck. A, I guess it's kind of a cowl neck. That's cute too. It's almost like a waffly knit um, kind of texture, if you can see that, with that maroon zebra stripe. It looks kind of boxy, but I don't mind that. That could be cute too. <gasps> you guys. Here's the sleeves on there. It has like the banded sleeves. Oh man. I might be in trouble with this edit. I know I said that last time too. Let's see. This is another top. Another dolman. I do like the dolmans and I love green. This is very long. Let's see. This is a W by Wantable, so this is like their own brand. Is this a dress? I can't tell. No, it's a top. Okay, it's just a dolman. So that's cute. I love green. I have a lot of green though, but I really like green, so it makes sense. <laughs> All right, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, only two more things. See, that's the thing when I get like accessories and stuff, I would, I would like rather have clothes. <laughs> All right, and this, what are you? Your top, okay. That's cute, very low V in the front, stretchy. Let's see, so it's like a surplice, is that what they call it? It's got a band on the bottom. Are you black or navy? You're black. Black with like kind of gold and white, kind of ditzy florally. That could be cute. It is kind of see-through. Can you see me? I can see you. <laughs> so you definitely would have to wear like a cami or something under this because, you know, that V goes really low. But dang, everything's super cute in this box. Okay, last thing. Are they all tops? Let's see. I was kind of hoping for like a skirt, but this is really, 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 really cute. Oh, super cute. Has a twist in the front. Is this the front? Yeah, it's the front. Buttons down the front. Well, okay, that's all right because it's a V in the front. I'm like, buttons down the front. That's really cute. Okay. You guys, let's try things on. Okay, so here's the first top. Technically the last top we um, took out of the pile, but it was the first on my pile. So here's the first top. Super cute. I love the buttons. I love the V-neck. It's got like, a slight dolman. The only thing I don't like, I think, is the length of it. You can't tell because I'm wearing black jeans. But the twist in front is kind of strange. Like the way it twists. I have my mirror over here right now, so <laughs> it's, I'm getting used to my new space. So that's like one of the only things I might not like about it is how this twist is. And if I do like it enough, I might try to see if they have it in a large instead of an extra large because it's a little long. But if I tuck it in, but I don't always like to tuck all of my tops in. But if I tuck it in, it's super cute. So this one's a maybe, but I like how Color blocking goes all the way around, the front and the back. I love the V, I love the top part, it's like so shimmery. 
Look how shimmery it is with my new dark hair. Mm -mm -mm. It's really cute. I like the buttons because they're not real buttons. <laughs> we all know my button issue. Oh, that's super cute. Okay, this is a maybe. Let's go to the next one. So here is the surplice top. I didn't put a cami under it, so we'll see how it goes. It is very, very cropped. Very cropped. And it's okay. I think maybe if I put a cami under it, I just don't want to get one out right now. <laughs> but I might. I might end up doing it. I probably will. I think if I wore a cami under it, my cami would come down here, and this would be like way up here because it is riding up a lot. Uh, the material's really, really nice, like it's slinky feeling, so I think that's what's contributing to it riding up and coming open. Uh, so I think it's a no for this one, but I really like the pattern. I like the idea of it. I think if it were in a different material and not so slinky, it would be better. But I can see how this would be really good for like a holiday party or something. Maybe with like a midi skirt, if you had like a neutral midi skirt with it, that'd be super cute. I don't, but <laughs> they're all patterned. I have a leopard one and like a floral one. Um, but that would be cute. Yeah, I think this is a no though. It feels really nice though. So this dolman, it's just like a plain dolman. Uh, I don't, I don't know whether or not this belonged in this kind of edit. There's nothing like super, you know, make you shine, sparkle, whatever about it. Um, it's kind of clingy, as dolmans tend to be, but it's pretty color. It's very pretty color. It's very soft. Has that v-neck, but I'm just not feeling it. For this edit, I have a lot of green, like I said. Um, when I, when I try to pick shirts to wear to like film videos and stuff, I'm always like, I have so much green. <laughs> like, did I, did I wear green in the last video? Um, so I think this is a no as well. It's just, I, I have a lot of dolmens that are just plain as I fly away. So no to this one. Okay, I really like this one. I think this one is like pretty much Ideal. It has like the balloon slight balloon sleeve. It's not a turtleneck. It's more of like a little cobble neck there because if you watch my last video, we all know my issues with my short neck and turtlenecks and mock necks and things. So I think this one's really cute. It has that cute zebra. You can wear it like that. You can fold it over. Tuck it in. That's super cute. It's got that waffle knit, which I really love waffle knit kind of texture. I really like it. I don't have any zebra print stuff. I have like a lot of animal print, which I know a zebra is an animal, but you know what I mean, leopard print. So I think this one's cute. I think this one might be a yes, depending on the price. I do still have credit from you guys signing up. Thank you so much. Um, so I'm at least want to keep one thing from this box and this one might be it. Super cute. Let's do the let's do the last top. Also real quick, here is the earring. We can get in on that. What do we think? I think that's pretty. It's dainty like I said, but it's like you don't see that kind of shape a lot, I think. A little triangle. I like it. That might be a winner too. Yeah, I kind of like that. Especially like if you have your hair up or against my new dark, dark hair. I think that looks nice. Okay, let's do the last top. Okay, I'm on the fence with this one. I love the top part. The bottom part, I think is a little too clingy, but maybe I could just like, I don't know, what do you guys think? I kind of, mm, I don't know. Oh, let's see. Is that better? I kind of like that better than just like having the bottom be just like rounded straight like that. That's kind of cute. Cause everything else feels really good. The sleeves feel really good. It's that dolman. I 
I like the top. I like all the sparkly studs. I like that. Oh man. What do we think? I kind of like it tied. This is like perfect holiday -y, but you don't want to be like too overt, you know? You don't want to be like red and green, red and green, red and green. Nothing wrong with that. But, let me tuck it in. Like I like it tucked in. I think that's cute. Let's see. Or you could go like this. Little trick. Okay. Pretend like you're going to tie it in a knot and then take this part and then put it through your belt loop. And then you put it over like that. And then you have like your own little twist tuck kind of thing. So I like that better I think than it just hanging down. I don't know. What do you guys think? I like this one. It's probably like $74 I'll bet you because I feel like a lot of their things are $74. Maybe I have to double. Do I have to double? I don't know. I saw it on the internet. The internet never lies. Yeah, I think I like something like that better than it just being plain at the bottom there. That's cute. Okay, what do we think? And I, I really like the earrings. I think for sure I'm going to keep those. Um, I really like those. I think they're so cute. Okay. All right. Let's go over prices and see what I'm going to keep. For sure, I think the earrings and that zebra top, depending on the price, and maybe this. Okay. Let's go. Let's do prices. Okay. Let's go over prices. <sighs> this was a pretty good box. I forgot about that first top. Um, I tried on with like the glitter top and the buttons. That's a maybe too. So let's see. Um, the ruffle. Oh, okay, so the first thing on my items here is something I didn't get. And I think they accidentally put that green dolman in instead. So it was supposed to be a ruffle neck button front blouse in hunter green for $59. So I'll have to contact them and tell them that I didn't even get that in my box. So that's weird. Because um, that would have might have been nice if it had buttons down the front. Because that, that's, remember I said like that it was just too plain for this box? So that's what happened. Okay. So the next one is the Clara Waffle Mock Neck Top and Abstract Animal in Bordeaux by Sanctuary. And that's $59. So I don't think that's that. These boxes. Okay. If I were to see this in a store and it would say $59, I'd be like, nah. And now I'm like, oh, that's not bad. <laughs> it's not bad for this, this box. Uh, $59. So that's for sure a maybe. Like I said, I have credit um, from you guys, so thank you so much. The Cash Crossbody in Pewter by Urban Expressions is $42. So not going to keep that one because I don't need it uh, right now. The Surplus Front Blouse with Small Floral Print by Dex is $50, which was also really nice, but I think it's just too cropped for me. And, this, and that was uh, a little too low. Um, the Color Block Twist Front Button Down Top in Black and Extra Large by ACOA was $59 as well. So the two tops I like $59. The Studded Dolman Sleeve Sweater in Heather Gray, W by Wantable, was $79. So I don't think I want to spend $80 on that top. <laughs> so I think that's going to be a no because I had to like do something to the bottom for it to be cool. And then the Kelly Beaded Earrings were $32. So I'm for sure going to keep those. I'm going to decide if I want both of those tops and we'll see. So, oh, it was a pretty good box for Wantable price wise. I liked it. If you guys, like I said, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to watch my other videos, feel free. I think this is like my seventh or eighth Wantable. So, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time.